Stay tuned for the seventh inning stretch brought to you by Budweiser, the official beer of Major League Baseball. Great times are waiting. Grab some buds. Thomas Ian Nicholas from uh, Rookie of the Year. Good guy. We've had him on uh, in the past and a musician as well. And actually, uh, a show coming up uh, this evening. Thomas Ian Nicholas is with us from the Rookie of the Year. Henry Rowengartner is back. Glad to be back. Thank you for having me. Nice to see you. Lefty versus lefty here. James Russell to Freddie Freeman. Well, very much a winnable ball game. Oh, Need to keep post from zero. Bat. Look at that. Just played and by Russell. Out. That was like a Henry Rowengartner pitch. There you yes. Go. He's all grown up. <laughs> uh, yeah, it unfortunately does feel like yesterday. <laughs> How old were you when the movie was made? I was 12, 12 when we shot it here at, at Wrigley Field. Right after baseball season. We had to put up uh, camo net because all the ivy was, uh, of course, not surviving the beginning of winter. Right. And you got a show across the street coming up this evening. I do, yeah. G Man over Tavern. G Man Tavern. Uh, we had a shot uh, from the film uh, The Late John Candy. Um, I I've heard that he was a great guy. I don't know how much you he got was. to know him. Uh, we didn't, he didn't shoot during the same time that we did, but I met him afterwards. We did a PSA together and hung out. He had uh, purchased the bar from Only the Lonely and set it up in his uh, recording studio. Very nice. So I played video games with his son. My mom hung out and talked to him. He was an amazingly sweet man. It was a pitch to Hayward, and then it's on the outside corner. So what else do you have going these days? Uh, I've got a new TV show that starts in the fall on Fox called Red Band Society. I play a rock musician that uh, volunteers and plays music for the kids in the hospital ward. Okay. There we go. Line up. 